Uh, it is with great pleasure I welcome Dr. Bhavna. He is a topper in the recent NESS GI surgery examinations. Uh, welcome, Bhavna. How does it feel to talk the exams, get a great rank? Uh, uh, it was good, sir, actually, because uh, I've been preparing for a long time now. So, finally, to get there, like uh, it feels good. We had interacted on uh, during the last INISS as well. Uh, yes. Where uh, you had got got into the interview and we were helping you prepare for the interview as well. Yes. So, uh, how does it feel uh, after you know such a long journey and multiple attempts at you know uh, attempting the exam? So, how does it feel? Like uh, last time, I got till rank twelve. So, but still, I miss. Like it was a good rank, but still, I miss the seat. So, it was kind of I was uh, in a place of low like. So then I went through the toppers videos and saw like what mistakes I did, like what can I do to correct them. Uh, so my weaknesses were like I did not revise and I did not concentrate on questions. So I tried to correct that this time and put more effort into doing more questions so that I won't do silly mistakes in the actual exam. So, great, great, great. so Aura, before we you know get into your preparation, uh, tell us more about yourself. Where did you do your UG, uh, PG? And why uh, GI surgery overall? Uh, like I did from UG from NRA Medical College, Guntur, Andhra Pradesh, and uh, PG from Jipmer, Pondicherry. Okay. And, and uh, SP because uh, uh, I have in my JR ship, like to do assisting different cases, like I felt GI surgery was the one which uh, kept me interesting. And which I felt like, uh, okay, for the rest of my career, if it's something I want to do, then this will be interesting enough. Uh, like, no, for I think, me, uh, surgery was more interesting. GI has a great appeal for all of us as general surgeons because uh, abdomen is a fantastic organ. Yes. Right? Yes. Yes. So, yes. Uh, yes. So, uh, yes. Abdomen is a Pandora's box. And when you open the abdomen, uh, you really don't know what to expect. Uh, in PG time, three years, like we got more exposed to GI compared to others. Like peripheries were only four or five months where we are exposed to others, but the rest of the time it was GI surgery. And because of COVID, we have only emergency elective was less, and emergency is GI surgery mostly. Absolutely, absolutely. So that ended up being major cause for me, like because I got doing it repeatedly, and uh, because more emergency cases we are operating more of GI surgeries, so it kept me interesting. And I read more and more uh, the GI topics and it was interesting. So I wanted to pursue that. So Bhavna, when we were speaking, you were telling me that, you know, the, the core of your preparation was Sabiston medical tradition and the surgical GI surgery MCK band. So uh, tell us more about how you use Sabiston as a base of your preparation and then uh, use the question bank to uh, you know, augment it. So I think uh, what I heard from you was very interesting because uh, these days, a lot of students aren't reading Sabiston. So, I would just, you know, uh, wish that, you know, you elaborate a little more about it. Like, uh, during my MS exam, and uh, I prepared Sabiston only. Like, daily, I read only few topics. and But okay. I read Sabiston from all the chapters I read Sabiston for my MS exam. Okay. So, last uh, November also, during my preparation, I read Sabiston again. This time also I read like Sebastian was one thing which I read completely because it has a, it doesn't have everything but it has something about everything. Uh, okay. It doesn't go into great depths but uh, you can know all the topics and uh, in most of the recall videos like previous recall videos and all like which are topics are important only those particular topics I read from Shackleford. Because Shackleford and Bloomgat are extensive and I did not read them in M my MS and these are only 4-5 months and there is no way I will complete them now. Absolutely. So, absolutely. so only those recall videos topics only I picked up and read in Shackleford Bloomgat but Sebastian I read entirely. Okay, okay. And uh, how about the search of MCQs? Uh, like uh, you were telling me that you had revised the multiple of times. Uh, for November, uh, it, there were more than 2,500 MCQs. For November, I did the entire SG Q bank of searches. And now also, again, I did the entire QBank. The thing about the searches QBank I felt uh, interesting was they are at the standard of INESS. Because uh, INESS, the thing is, one, they will be asking clinical questions. Two, it 
uh, they will ask like double negatives sometime so uh, you have to be careful they'll just trick a word uh, so the answer will change and uh, and the recent updates also so okay. uh, there is a lot of change from the ness questions to neat ss questions and there are no one liners in ness so the search test queue bank also is uh, appropriate to ness i felt because most of them are clinical questions and uh, whatever silly mistakes i felt that i did in november um, like most of them were like these things like uh, not true except uh, sometimes in the last 10 to 15 minutes uh, you will have more questions there will be lengthy questions question will be lengthy options will be lengthy so i sort of panicked that time and i did not read the questions properly which led me to do silly mistakes Make so uh doing a question bank repeatedly i saw like uh, yeah this is a tricky part and uh, these are the trick questions that i should be careful about so that is very really interesting i think it's very interesting because uh, a lot of students need to read sabistan and that's what i've been emphasizing again and again and solving mcq should be the basis of your preparation and i think you have elaborated that quite extensively uh, over here uh, babra one more question i have uh, how do you structure your preparation you had prepared for i think four or five months right now or slightly even more but uh, how was your day like and how did you structure your preparation uh, for november exam i prepared for two months and now again i prepared for three months okay uh, so in november itself like uh, i uh, had my notes i did one revision and i did search test queue bank and mm -hmm. i read sebastian once so okay. now these three months because i already have the like whatever queue bank extra points are there like uh, extra topics which were not covered in sebastian but there are there in shackleford and bloom but like i read and made notes last time itself so this time i did like three revisions actually mm -hmm. uh, so and uh, first revision i did completely i completed my first revision and the second revision i did q bank first okay and then i saw because i already did the q bank once i read did the revision and still i made a mistake so those are the topics which i am not retaining at all so i the during my second revision i spent a lot of time on those topics which i am making repeated mistakes good truth and the third revision i did again my notes makes sense i think i think it's a very organized uh, way you have gone about doing your preparation uh, i think uh, what you said is is very useful to every student preparing for ins and i'm really grateful that you've been here and uh, okay. i must uh, i must i must thank you because uh, your validation of the circus queue bank is a great motivation to the entire team this dr gopi was doing his gs and i sat out firstly and created many of these mcqs so, uh, uh, i think as a the grand test uh, last ins is grand test that was like lot of uh, previous recall questions were added like not all because uh, the topics were the same uh, because mm. uh, Uh, there are some topics like GB carcinoma is one topic. So what all the topics were important, one question was included in that. So the eighty questions were represented to topics of the previous seniors. So I felt like that grand test was also very good. True, true, true. Thank you so much, Bhavna. Thank you so much for being here with us today. I am really grateful, and I wish you all the very best. I really hope that you get the seat of your choice. It's a great rank, and I wish you all the best for the future. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much.